This is my servo driven wiper arm. It comes across, there's like a silicon sheet on here which has slots cut in it. There's a wire brush thing off the top of um, a golf ball brush, I believe it's off, and I've chopped the end off and it has a ball end to fasten it on in there and these two balls squeeze this silicon sheet on so I've had this well this idea on here a long time and it's been good the only problem was if I needed to I'd take the arm off and readjust it for some reason it was almost upside down to how it is now so that the board can move this head there's like a, a nut, a screw in a way that goes in the servo a grips on a horn what the term like an aeroplane model aeroplane horn in, in here that screws on there but because it was almost up the other way, it would quite often fall or be very awkward. I'd have to hold my hand on it to try and catch the board and while I was screwing it and mucking about. But now as you see, this part is on the top, so the screw is on the top. So it's easier to get in at. Unscrew it, move the arm a bit, screw it back on. I'll show you what working just now. I'll, I'll wait until the. Uh, I'll actually start up a pin and we might get some moves. So that, that's the idea. Before it starts pinning, it'll come across, go backwards and forwards a few times, as you will see just in a few minutes. I'll cut out the video while it's heating up and getting started. Well, the beginning of the pin so to speak let's see so the head should stop somewhere about here when the arm comes across okay I'll probably move down just a little bit well the very first thing it does in my start G code is move make sure that the servos arm is right out the way at the in my case at the back <coughs> excuse me then it does a home like this so it knows the position it does like a triple check on that servo arm asset and move back then the head moves to a position where it can wipe the nozzle like so and you can see the wire brush there, I think it's brass. And then it does the auto level. And then after that it'll start pinning. Just let do this part here. So that's the first auto level. Well, should call it tram and melee using a BL touch. Yeah, thumbs up for that BL touch there. So I'll try and show you this servo arm if I can. Sorry about the light here. 